all right guys i'm here again please like subscribe and share please if you like my videos please share them all right today the day we're gonna cook some we're gonna bake sorry me and me bad talking right we're gonna bake a chicken mm, we're gonna bake a chicken so this we have the chicken washing already you know with some lime and lime and um some vinegar all right so we're going to use the lime, we already wash out the inside, we'll scrub out the inside of the chicken. Make sure so you take out the stuff them from inside of the chicken, right? Then there's somewhere about ya, right? This come in the chicken, um, pack or whatever it is, right? Make sure you have that out of the chicken inside. Now cookie with it, right? Make sure you say out, right? And then you're going to wash your chicken inside and out. And I'm going to do that, guys. You know me, I'm a one, and the, I'm one man and the thing. All right, and today we're going to have, uh, what we're going to use to season this chicken is, uh, guys, forget the dot, the water. Don't make it thing, okay? Some people don't like it. But my life, I make sure that my chicken wash nice. You know, so this today we're gonna use today we're gonna use seasoning we're gonna have uh, this is a combination of seasoning i i mix in here garlic ginger some uh, um some island spice um black pepper some bay leaf and emptying there you know some onion garlic powder also uh, all right, and um, I have a little browning. So I may well put, I'm going to combine all this into one and then rub it over the chicken. All right, so I may have some browning. I have some, uh, you know, fish sauce. I have some wish sauce. Who can pronounce it? Not me. You notice everything me pronounce bad. Because I just saw me talk, me chat bad. Yeah, so wish sauce. All right, so I mean, um, me sauce and whoever see this I eat whoever see this this is skillion powder right so we're gonna use some of this thing in it and I did um mixing this seasoning here I did have three cubes of these okay maggi vegetable right so no yam pork <laughs> is vegetable right and today our oh, guys we're gonna have it with noodles all right we're going to have the chicken with the noodles. I'm going to put some broccoli. <clears throat> we have this noodle, all right, which is also vegetable noodle. All right, so we're going to fix this up later. Let me show you how we're going to fix this up nicely. And here are some things we're going to put in the chicken, some rough chops, some sweet pepper. And uh, uh, guys, I'm going to make a... This is garlic, right? I'm gonna make a garlic butter. This here, I chop up the, the mince up the garlic with some thyme and some rosemary, all right? So that's what I'm gonna make her butter with it, all right? This is some cabbage for the noodle later. I'm gonna wash these off and mince them up smaller. And then these are to go in my chicken, all right? Guys, I'll be back, okay? Please, if you watch my video, please like, share, and subscribe. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. So, guys, here I'm going to season it. I wash the chicken and you know, wash it off good and wash off all the stuff with lime. Already juice the lime or lemon on the chicken itself, and I I um, mix up the seasoning. I did add a little bit of cooking wine, which is this one here red cooking wine and I did add some soy sauce and some um, oyster sauce to this All right so now these are the garlic onion powder some island spice some salt some I did have some turmeric guys turmeric give things a nice a taste so I did have some turmeric to it this is my um, herb butter here alright so this is Time and um, time and that other stuff. So, 
So it's just thyme and rosemary mixed with the butter. And I'm going to put it under the skin of the chicken. But first, and I did add some oil, right? A little bit of cooking oil. So I don't have to add that later. And then, guys, I'm going to stuff and pregnate the chicken. Get the chicken pregnant with some onion and, and some tomato. Don't put too much stuff in the chicken, guys. These are not going to go in the chicken. These are going to go in the pan itself, right? So we're just going to cook this vegetable in the pan, but not in the chicken. Because you don't want to put too much things in the chicken because it won't, um, you know, it won't get cooked. It's, it's, it's not too good if you do that, all right? So I'm going to cook those potatoes, but these are going in the chicken, all right, inside the chicken. So now I'm going to put the seasoning over the chicken, all right, and just rub it in and out everywhere, all right. This is some browning and everything else I show you guys. And I just mix it in to one, and I'm going to soak the chicken in it. Get everything off because none can waste, right? So I'm going to use my hand and I'm just going to rub it in. Rub it up in the chicken, browning everything there. Right? So just make everything goes in. Rub it up, soak it up. Soak it on the chicken. Guys, me use browning and then things because me don't like to see the chicken white. Me hate to see white chicken and white food. <laughs> other than the rice are what's supposed to be white all right so you're just gonna rub up the chicken good as best as you can make it get some everywhere upon it right and this is the little stuff them will come out of it all right so like that and now we're gonna we're gonna stuff these sweet peppers and stuff inside the chicken the tomatoes sweet pepper and so on Alright, so we're just going to add this inside chicken to just, you know, my fast guys, you know, fast, fast, fast things may I do, right? So just add it in there, not too loaded because you need the, the chicken for cook, alright? So we just going to make this, guys, I forgot my butter, alright? So here, guys, I did kind of get out the space to put the butter in. Alright, so we're going to add the butter inside. Some stuff. We're going to add some nice old big piece inside the chicken. And when it's soaking, it's going to taste good. Alright, so we're just going to put in the butter in there so it can melt and soak in our chicken. Alright. And we're going to do this and just let it sit for 15 minutes and and I'm going to put it in the oven. Right? So it's just going to soak in this good juice and we'll be back. Alright guys, I'm about to put it in the oven. This is it here. I just put a little bit of water so I can make some sauce. I'm going to show you how to make a nice cover up sauce for it later. So this is it. We're going to just put it in the oven and make it go and cook and do its thing. And then we'll come back. Guys, okay, see the chicken? Look at that. I'm going to show you all how to make a nice old, nice old sauce with this. Alright, so see it there. It's going to cover it back down, make it cook some more. See it a cook. Hmm? Nice. And then we're going to open it, make it brown little bits. Alright, so we'll make it go on some more. They cook. This is how it looks so far, so good, guys. Oh, can't wait to eat up this year. All right, guys, this is the noodle for the baked chicken. All right, so I'm getting ready to cook the ba the, um, the noodle. But, and this is what I'm putting in. All right, so we just, this is like a vegetable thing. All right, this is what we're going to have. We're going to have a lot of vegetable with it. So there's the water with salt and oil, okay? A little bit of oil and some salt. But what I'm going to do with the broccoli is I'm going to dip them. I'm going to throw them in the water. Everything's already rinsed and cut up, right? So the broccoli, I'm just going to throw them in the water real quick and take them back out. All right. So they're not going to stay in there. We're going to take them back out. We're just dipping them, right? This is how I get my broccoli to be crispy and nice 
and I still yes you know good all right so that's it that's it we're just going to take them back out sorry guys all right we're just going to take them back out take them back out we don't need them in there long just take them back out that's all you're doing this is a trick do you know in them people with them broccoli and it, 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 it cook but it's nice and crispy this is it this is it don't leave them in there all right so this is the pasta water but instead of me a boil different water for your broccoli where they go the same place me just dip in the broccoli in them in here all right and take it back out that's it it done the broccoli cook ready right crispy you know safi safi and mushy mushy but it the right it thing all right so we just go open the pasta and we go um actually before me do it me a woman love me garlic again i don't know how to stress it i think you guys know by now me love me garlic and me, me season up my water right so after me i put this is garlic powder i'm using just some regular off name brand garlic powder but name brand no matter guys because i see them product i see them garlic i see them onion whatever right so we want taste we already put salt in there all right so we just put in a little bit of garlic uh, uh, and onion powder in our water and then we're gonna put in the pasta we're not gonna leave it for long we're gonna almost dip it like the broccoli because this this noodle here is vegetable noodle you don't need to cook long just a little bit of time you see the name of it all right and i'm gonna just cook it and i'll be back not long not even five minutes all right see it's in the pot i'm just gonna let it go for maybe five minutes and watch it all right you have to keep your eyes on this type of noodle because it will mash out it don't take long for cook so me just go watch it eyeball it drain it off and um quickly so it won't mash out right so just leave it there for cook for about five minutes not more just five minutes or so or until tender <laughs> al dente however you want carly make it cook to your likings and then when you cook to your likings you throw it um off and cool it off quickly okay all right so my likings are almost there make it go a like couple more minutes and i'm gonna strain it off and easy thing just mixing everything to it and that's it all right all right guys so here it is so this is some vegetable pasta all right we're just waiting on the chicken and then we're gonna plate it and eat it all up so thanks for watching guys i'll be back when the chicken is finished it's still in the oven still going all right this is the vegetable pasta guys look at it nice and brown in a burn or no 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 yeah, so just in you know, a burn, a brown. Uh -huh. So this is this, you see how the sauce thick? This is what I put over it and base it. Not too sweet, not too nothing, right? I did remove the vegetable. I did remove it from it, so I won't it won't cover over that sweet sauce. So this was the you know the little piece of chicken parts and the. The carrot is suck up in my chicken juice because it bake with it. I just remove it before I put the sauce. And guys, this is the pasta again. Alright, so this is all going together, guys. I don't know if I'm going to plate anything and picture anything, right? I know so I like to see plating and this and that. Guess what, guys? I, I don't know if I'm going to plate it. But guys, thanks for watching. See how pretty it is? This is a nice old big chicken, right? So you can put all your toppings back on it or on the side of your plate, right? Vegetable, vegetable, juicy and nice, you know? Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. See you next time. Remember to like, share, subscribe, all right? And comment. Okay, thank you.